I'm going to temper. Mm -hmm. I am quite passionate with my voice, though, which people can perceive as me feeling a different motion than I actually am. But I've had that all my life. Not the easiest to read. I understand that. I can't stop it. It's part of my personality. <laughs> It that way. Yep. The classic. I told you about that earlier. All right, we've got a quick down here, so we're not as bad situation. And we've got a pain res. This means we can move. That's enough. Um, that's enough kind of uh, of an attack, which gives us some freedom. Unlike that last game where it was just horrible, wasn't it? it was no pain res. Uh, didn't get a down for. A, well, it weren't like ages, but. With the no pain res, it was bad. I ignored him, his obsession. I think they're going to be waiting. I just saw them. They ran away. They're over here. Hello. I might just break it. But notice on this one, I'm not really needing to tunnel, right? Because it's more... So, oh, well, well, she's right. Uh, no, she's injured. Um... I do the smartest decision, right? So the smartest decision right now is to cause a lot of pressure because I've got a good start, right? So causing pressure right now will do more for me than tunneling someone, right? But if I have a bad start and I don't get any pain res for a while, going for that same person will actually do more for me. Um, where? There we go. Will actually do more for me than this. Do, do you get what I mean? Because I've got momentum right now. They can't go on gens. I keep blocking them. Like, there's massive, massive momentum in my favor right now. They're all over the place. But if they had finished three gens here and I didn't get to regress any gen, I'd be in a really shit situation. Do you understand? So I guess a big part of playing killer really well is um, how quick you can assess the situation you're in. And then adapt to that situation. Right? Because as you can see here, I'm not tunneling. But I'm not doing it for the survivors. I'm doing it because this makes the most sense in the situation I'm currently in. Do you get me? I just try to inform and make people understand, like, when you play killer at a good level, what you have to actually do if you are going against small survivors. And sometimes this might not be. Like, this could be a, a chill one, right? Because of the buffer. I haven't done a gen yet, but I always have to treat it as if they are, because if they, um, are you injured? You're not injured. Where'd that girl go? We can get him, that's fine. I lost my stacks, but we'll get another pain res. Right, so what's dangerous now, right? is I've hit everyone with the pain res. I've got 25% regression. I've got 100% overall around all these gens. I've got loads of slowdown because of the um, uh, dead man, right? But now I don't have any regression. So now they can start trucking along with the gens quite quickly. And this is where I become weak because of the uh, the nerf to pain res. Like, it, it makes you really weak at this point. So if you've ever gone against a really, really strong player and they're using this kind of build, Understand that even though you've got no gens done right now, the killer is way weaker now. So you shouldn't rage quit as if there's no chance of winning. Because now I will have no regression. I still feel confident being able to um, go around the map though. So no need to tunnel still. Isn't tunneling always the best strat? Not in this situation. If I tunneled in this situation, I would have only done 25% uh, regression. And I would have only blocked uh, gens that people let go of. They would have been gens done. The place where... Okay. The pl oh, he has DS as well. Wow. See, so I was only wanting you to tunnel when they can get out of it, you see. Uh, which makes sense. But it's like, I'm not just going to do what you want <laughs> right you're my you're my opponent i'm not playing for you just like you're not playing for me we play for ourselves 
there you go. I've, I've given you the viewpoint, the understanding, not justification. Um, if you want to challenge your beliefs on it, you should, at least. Maybe, you know, you'll, you'll have a different perspective, which is always healthy. Uh, if you don't want to, it's fine. Don't need to. There you go. Nice. <laughs> well, there's a rage quitter. But if there's anything you could take away from what I just said there, please stop thinking it's as black and white as you just tunnel, then you win. Because it isn't. Okay. It's about assessing what's happening. Assessing where your pain reses are. Assessing... Uh, you know, what gens are getting blocked, assessing how the survivors are playing through the gen blocking. Like, it's looking at a lot of factors. I could see these guys were not playing well around the gen blocking. So, me gen blocking and going for more hooks and going for more pain res will do a lot of damage. Uh, if I was just only one person and they kept on the gens, they'd do a lot more damage. Because they would keep on the gens and then no pain res would activate if I kept going for the same person, you see. So this was the smartest way to play versus this team. I assumed. I could have been wrong. But my assessment was that. <laughs> Alright. You think you saw a survivor hiding? Yeah, probably. When it gets to this point, they're in such a, a bad place. That... Oh my god, this guy. <laughs> I tried to grab him as he went in, but I went for the attack. If he played smart there, he could have jumped out and uh, I would have only got an injury. But The ghost lady that's the invisible one. Are you on about spirit? Uh, experience what I like if you want to give a build. Um, other than that, I just play what I feel like. <clears throat> but maybe. Super quick catch up. Way faster than he realizes. Already on you. Reason why Blight's so strong. The catch up. Ah! See, I wouldn't have caught him there. If I didn't have rapid and save the best, I would not have been able to get him to this pallet. And he would have got to this pallet, pre dropped it, and then probably broke, and then maybe got to another pallet. That's that's one thing people don't realize with uh, with catch up. It's, it's quite important. Yeah, Can you imagine? I know he's in one again, trying to go for the uh, stun. But there's no tell, is there, when someone's in a locker? There's no breathing. There's no indication at all. So you're basically just flipping a coin as the killer. Oh, hello. Where's your locker? Where's your locker? Where's your locker? Uh, uh. <laughs> Sit. Hmm. <laughs> Who's saying a log is gonna be hilarious? I have a feeling he probably wanted. Well, maybe not at the end. Maybe what to get the patch. 
Where's your head on? Where's your head on? <laughs> yeah. Uh, 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 uh. Do 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 do